The big game is fast approaching, but wait, you still haven't got your tickets. You've spent hours searching, but you're still confused about ticket prices. Time to stop searching. Visit TicketCompare.com. We compare ticket prices for all the popular leagues and tournaments for you. We work only with the most trustworthy sites, so you can have peace of mind when buying your tickets. Compare prices, buy tickets, get to the game. TicketCompare.com. Buying tickets made simple. Big man. Boss sits down. That was excellent, you know. I really, 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 really enjoyed it. I can't put into words how much I enjoyed the comeback. It was like having a debut again. I was ecstatic, you know. The crowd showed a very fantastic support, and I was over the moon with everything. Was it, was it everything you expected once you stepped into the ring? 100% look. I started a cat fight with a kiss and uh, we ended it with a bit of dancing and a couple of punches and I, I, I enjoyed it, you know. It was about uh, coming back, getting some ring rust off, getting under the lights again, like I said, having a little dance under the lights and just getting used to uh, being back in the ring. It's been a long time and I'm happy to be back. It's a bit of a loose thing. He did, he did. I was uh, enjoying myself too much in there and I apologise to the referee, but it is entertainment. So where's this taking now? What's your next step? Well, I've just been told by Frank I'm, I'm fighting again in Belfast on August the 18th. The show continues. The roadshow moves to Belfast. Can't wait. And is that enough, what you've done tonight, to do, do it again, step up? 100%. Listen, the, the opponent was quite short um, and he was light, which meant he was quick. Um, he didn't come to fight, basically. He came to run, run around the ring and enjoy himself, basically. Um, I, I opted for a bigger opponent, but we couldn't really get anybody. There was nobody available. So we took Seth, he had a good record and tough chin. And um, he took me a few rounds. I was happy with it. Very happy, actually. You wanted more? Listen, I was prepared to do 10, 12, 25. But I wasn't like maximum nervous, but I'm not going to say I wasn't nervous. After so long and you're like going under the lights again and being the main event and big crowd, it, it, was, um, it was a bit... Dodgy, really, but listen, I enjoyed it. I wouldn't change a thing. I was happy with how everything went. Um, on to the next one. I won, 26 and 0, 19 inside. Not a mark on me. I'm going to go home tonight and have a pizza and then uh, get back on it tomorrow. Um, it was what it was, to be honest. He took a couple of hard punches and he didn't fancy it, did he? He told his corner not to send him out for round five. Um, and I was saving him for round five because I said to everyone I'd knock him out in round five. He got, an, he got, got, he got caught it. with a, that uppercut, I think, in the fourth round. He got clipped with the turn. He said, I think that was, his, that was it. Then he didn't want to know. Simple as that. Listen, I was fit. I was ready. I could have fought anybody. I was happy with the performance. Very happy with the performance. Um, on to the next one. No, listen, I'm not really bothered. I'm, I'm ready. I've trained hard. I've done a lot of training. Uh, six months, to be precise. I'll, I'll pick your pants. Um... Whoever they pick, they pick. Doesn't really matter to me. They're all the same anyway. Whether it's Seth or whether it's um, whoever, they're all the same really, and the outcome will always be the same. I'll always win. Because all I do is win, 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 no matter what. And that's it. Listen, they're all bums anyway. Wilder, Joshua, Parker, whoever else, they're all shit. They're all as good as Manuel Seth or whatever his name was. And listen, I'll have a world title by the end of the year, no problem. And if you liked it, thank you very much. And if you didn't like it, well, blame Ben. And that's it. Because <laughs> <laughs> he told me to do it, didn't you, Ben? Tyson, <laughs> so, by the way, how much does uh, Tony Bellew fight? How is Tony Bellew? Oh. It's up to Tony Bellew. I Listen, got any I want someone big. Small ones, I don't like them. Big. Look at Joshua Wilder. They're all over six foot five. So I've got to prepare for people like that. I understand. Big, big, big guys. Big, slow, ugly fellas. That's who I want. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry? Uh, I, I, you know, I'm pretty realistic from the beginning. I told everybody from the beginning, don't think we're going to be pulling in big names for his first fight. He's going to have a few fights to get the rust out of his system. And that's how we, we move forward. We picked Manuel Char simply because... I Sorry, Manuel Char. We picked... Um, Seth 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 because he fought Manuel Char and he'd gone 10 rounds with him. And that's what I was looking for. Somebody had gone some rounds. Um, as soon as he got clipped, 
he got that uppercut, I think it was in the fourth round, and then obviously um, he, he sat out, which I was, I've got to be honest, I was a bit disappointed with, but I, was, I suppose I'll see where they were going with that. Frank but, wanted him sprawling on the canvas, Frank, didn't you? <laughs> yeah. I want to, no, I just, Another 10 I want to seconds. see you get some, get some, some more, more rounds under. And realistically, I don't care what anyone says, you know, he says it himself, nervous for the couple of rounds, you know, coming into that crowd. I think that's the best reception he's had. And if, if I'm brutally honest, I could have knocked him out 10 seconds, really. Yeah. Could have done him in the first round, that's being honest. But what, what would that have done me? I got four rounds instead of 30 seconds, basically. Um, and I enjoyed it. I got a good little four rounds in. And TV exposure, baby! Exactly. And, he's, <laughs> and, he's got, and he's got another uh, well, number stone and a half to shift. Yeah, there's still a bit so to go. You know, losing all that weight, you, you know, it's draining. And I think he's done brilliantly, you know, in doing that and getting to where he's at. So a bit more weight off, and I think it's just step up, step up each time. The two champions, Wilder and uh, Joshua, are both out of action anyway. So no way that fight was going to. Ha- he, he would have taken him for his first fight back, Anthony Joshua. I know that for a fact. But Anthony Joshua's fighting Povetkin. I think Wilder's got his mandatory, so they're out of act. They'll fight this year. They won't fight again until next spring. And in the meantime, he's not sitting on his backside. We've got to just keep getting rounds under his belt and get him in, in more competitive fights. And that's what we're going to do. The next one's on the 18th of August at Windsor Park on a Carl Frampton bill. And uh, I'm just looking forward to it. I'm looking forward to seeing him back in action. I know Ben and him are going to continue to work very hard in the gym. And they, got, they know they've got lots of things to work on. And he's happy. He's in a good place. And, he's, and, the, and the public love him. They like him. And I'm pleased for him that, that he's finally getting... Uh, Can we get someone seven foot ten next time, uh, Frank? I'll, so nobody's I'll got any complaints. I'll stretch. I'll sh- at a stretch. What's no. a realistic time scale for, 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 you know, if you're talking world heavyweight unification? Well, those two guys are tied up, aren't they? That's the point. That's the point of it all. They're tied up. They've both got fights, and they ain't going to fight twice this year. You know, he's made it very clear, Anthony Joshua, isn't he? He's fighting in the in the autumn. So if he's fighting in the autumn, let's say he fights in September. If it is September, he ain't going to fight in December. That's for sure. So it'd be, you, you've got to say how it is, not what everybody, all the rubbish people are putting out there. That is how it is, they are the facts. In the meantime, he's got to be busy, he's got to get fights, and it's stepping up each time, and we'll step up next time. And I want him to get some rounds. It's all about him getting rounds, it's all about getting in there, getting that rust out of his system. And first, tonight was the first major step, and that was a great step to get in there, get that nervousness away, get on with it, and do what he had to do. Frank, you and it is, it's, this is a process, as I said from the beginning. We'll we'll work for it at our speed. Nobody else is going to dictate what it is at our speed. The objective is for him to get back the belts he didn't, you know, he never lost in the ring, and that is going to take, you know, a bit of time.